How you doing? My name is Michael Sierra. Here at DVS, I'm going to show you how to wrap a machine. Come with me. I just finished wrapping this Duravan 54BE. Let's take a look at the process. Here we have the Duravan 54BE. This is a beverage machine. It also can vent snacks. This is one of 14 machines. And today I'm going to show you how we wrap the sides. The front's already done. Come check it out. This is the left side of our machine. First of all, I always want to clean the machine, make sure it's free of any debris. Get this laid out in the machine to where my magnets will hold this in place. Once the wraps on there, you start to get a, a feel of how the layout goes. And now I'm going to line it up. Slicing off any of the excess vinyl helps when applying it. Why you guys bother me? Here we have the left side of the machine. I'm going to apply this just slightly on here. Take a step back, see if it's level. Here on the side in the front has to line up, so I'm going to pay attention to um, my design here. Lining it up is a major point of wraps. If you don't have it lined up, your wrap's not going to come out right. Get it lined up as best we can. Always have your front level. Once your wrap is lined up and you got your font level, we're gonna now apply the wrap. Putting our, putting our magnets in the middle will help secure the wrap and allow me to really work the vinyl and applying it. So here you're seeing me, I'm taking off the front part and I'm letting the backing stick. Thanks to the machine, I'm just gonna pull this front down a little bit and I'm gonna slice off the backing. This backing is what keeps the vinyl Protected and you're on a clean environment, you will get debris on your wrap. Be careful. Here I have a little flake. I'm just gonna clean it off and we're gonna bring it up. With our magnets holding it in place, we can then start to lay down our vinyl. And here, here's where things get interesting. Working out any creases, any bubbles, you work, just work slowly, work all the way up. I like to take my vinyl from the machine and give myself nice strokes. Nice clean strokes, no scratching of the machine, eliminating bubbles, eliminating creases. After a lot of practice, you too can wrap like me. <laughs> Here we're just doing the same thing. We're working out bubbles. If I get a big bubble, I'm gonna bring it back a little bit. And I'm just gonna work it again slowly. This ensures a nice, even um, adhesive lay down for the vinyl, and it also ensures longevity. Now at the top, just gonna line it up, come down. And here we are, we are now towards the bottom. The font is level, everything's nice and nice and straight. I'm gonna take the bottom backing off. By lifting up your vinyl, you're able to push down the backing. Bring the backing out. Release and pull. Same process like the top. Establish your middle to work outwards. These magnets are only here to help you hold your Vinyl down, you're down, you can now take them off. Vinyl has a lot of give, has a lot of strength. You're able to work with it. You're also able to heat it up. Best working temperature, 72 degrees. Right here, we have some rivets. We're just gonna work right over those. Sometimes you gotta pull back that vinyl. You just hold it up and work it slowly, evenly. And so you too have a million dollar wrap.